What's good? <laughs> yeah. What is good? Maximum post, please! Whoa, whoa, wait a minute, Mr. Postman! Why is it not focusing? There you go. This is a DVD. And I've got a funny feeling that this is going to be... Cry, little sister. This is going to be Lost Boys. Oh, it's not. It's, oh, oh. The Grudge. Yes, mate, in a steel case. Limited steel back. No, steel book. <laughs> steel book edition, mate. Nice, nicey, nicey. Who's this from? Gaming creator of the year. Absolutely, mate. Gaming Creator of the Year, which reminds me, I've been, I've been nominated for Gaming Creator of the Year again this year, okay, for GSCon. I'm going to be in, in Manchester in August. I'll leave the link in the description and you can use my code for 10% off, okay? So I'm going to be there, mate, from the 5th to the 6th in August, okay? Please, please, if you could vote for me again, it'd be absolutely amazing if I could win for the second year in a row. Um, but also, if you could come and see me, it'd be amazing, mate. It'd be amazing. Apparently, there's 70 people so far gonna, uh, of the Casperians, all right? And there's 300 tickets left. There's 300 tickets left. Please come over to Manchester and meet me. It'd be brilliant, mate. All right. Mr. Peter Green from Dorset. Look at you. Hey, Peter Green, mate. I will read this, man, because I've got loads. I've got loads to open. I've got loads. I love the bloody grudge. I do love the grudge. It's an amazing film. And the ring. I might have to go quick with the letters, guys. Oh, I got a wedding invite from Graham and Vicky. Hey, Casper. My name is Graham. Pronounce Graham. <laughs> you little bastard. <laughs> Me and my wife to be, Vicky, absolutely love watching your YouTube channel. We came across it during lockdown and haven't missed an episode since. Wow. We're hooked on your freaky deaky videos. They give us a maximum chicken scare and shit out uh, and scare the shit out of us. We're getting married on Fe uh, Friday, 8th of September, and would love if you could be there to introduce us into the room as man and wife. What the hell? Let's have a little look. It depends. If this is shit, you're getting fuck all. That's a joke, by the way. <laughs> look at the eyeballs. Look at the eyes. No, no blue. Look at the eyeballs! <laughs> four, I'm not going to sit here and read all four of these. I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. There's a card. Hang on. Here's a card. Hey, hey, look at that. Look at that, they. Hey, that's one tough. Dear Casper, sorry, I'm a big fan of yours. I watch your videos uh, every night when I, when I can't sleep as I suffer from anxiety and depression since losing my mum last year. Just hearing you, your catchphrases make me laugh, and that's what I need right now, so thank you. Keep doing what you're doing and keep rambling it. From Sophie from Essex. Oh, Sophie, mate. I'm so sorry that you're going through that stuff. Anxiety. An uncertainty of the future. Live for today. Okay? Live for today. Don't worry about the future. Live for today right now. And hopefully this video makes you laugh and makes you feel a little bit better, okay? If it doesn't, watch the next one and then and the others and then like get, get my views up, right? Hey, hey, it's a Casper site. Hey, mate, I, do you know what? I, funny enough, I haven't got my, my um, bracelet on today from Stephen. Mate, Stephen, thank you so much, mate. I'm gonna, do you know what? I'm going to wear that today. It's too small, mate. It's, I'm so sorry. It's too small. I'll have to give it to my son or my daughter or something. Or my, or, or my missus. My missus might have it. Guys, thank you so much, man. It like... Generosity on another level. Right, we, we got to get on, mate. We got to get bloody on. We got to get bloody on. I'm so sorry if those box openings were like quick rapido, mate. It's just because I had a lot of them and I feel really bad if I don't open up the things in front of you guys. So I saw a little tweet yesterday, right? And it's from the channel. So spooks. Okay, make sure you go to his channel, subscribe, and do the thing. And he said, 
he's got some footage coming up that you'd never seen before and he's super excited about it and i was like oh shit yes mate let's go all right so i thought that we could revisit his channel now today we're going to watch two videos because one of them is only on for like 11 minutes so i thought well let's just combine instead of a top five we'll do a top 10. it's one from a month ago one from three weeks ago without further ado dar diddly day let's do this Shh. go on says spooks Mm, yeah, yeah! Hello everyone, my Hello. name is Sir Spooks, and today we'll take a look at five scary videos. But before we begin, make sure to subscribe to my channel so you don't miss any future uploads. Mm. Alright, let's begin. Imagine you're simply out for a nice relaxing drive in the middle of the night. This better not be CCTV footage of the like the dash cam footage of the legs, mate. When See suddenly you notice times. something utterly crazy and unbelievable. That is exactly what happened to the person driving in this TikTok video. In the footage, we watch someone driving around in Merida, Mexico, Merida. in the middle of the night. The road seemed to be fairly deserted. At one point in the footage, the man driving takes a turn around a corner, and that's when it can be seen. Huh? Take a look and see. Holy shit! No, 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 no. Okay, so, so that is, that's the lights from the city below. That's the lights. Is it? It has to be. Yeah, the man. That's like nightclub lights flashing up into the sky, man. Because I'm not being funny, but if the lights were that bright, the the ray of the lights would be would be lighting up the underside of the the the, the ship. At least. I mean, you'd see some sort of shadow, you know? You would. As soon as the Straight driver rounds the, the corner, a large set of lights formed in a ring can be seen floating in the sky off in the distance before the video ultimately ends without any sort of explanation. It's a nightclub light! Of course, we will never know what this is for sure. It's a fucking nightclub light! Light, blah, 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 blah. But the popular theory is that this driver encountered a UFO of alien origin. No! in the middle of the night. But is it possible that this could be something else entirely? A nightclub light! What do you guys make of this highly eerie video? Do you think that this TikTok user managed to capture genuine evidence of no. alien life? Or is this something far less sinister? Be sure to let me know your ideas in the comments below. Number four! A woman on TikTok posted a highly unsettling video in which she explains just how terrified she is after a recent incident that managed to occur while she was babysitting. She explains that she was simply sitting on the couch with the boy, just trying to relax when suddenly some genuinely crazy things started to occur. Oh God. She promises that the entire video has been untouched and unedited. And she says that she knows something is off in the house. <sighs> so with all of that out of the way, let's take a look. Okay. Oh shit, mate. This is going to freak me out. Here we go. Get ready, mate. Get ready. Turn the volume up. Let's go. This seems legit already, mate. This seems legit. What is gonna happen? Is some shadow bass is gonna walk down the stairs? Oh, crawl, mate! It's gonna be fucking crawling. It's gonna be like doing this art shit. It's gonna be like all that down the stairs, mate. Run! Fuck it is! No, it ain't. Oh! 
What the hell? What? As you can see, the, the little girl smiles. The little girl's bloody smiling. Hang on a second. The baby said, Hang on a second. Look, look at the smile on her face. Yeah, well done. You just ruined the whole video, love. Get to bed. Get to bed. Wait till your parents come home. No, it's the babysitter. Okay, it's the babysitter saying, should we do something fun? Should we make a scary video? Next. As you can see, the babysitter is simply trying to enjoy her time when suddenly a bunch of random things start falling down the staircase directly behind them, seemingly for no reason. Just These two kids just ah, eat lolly, uh, uh, uh. <laughs> just by taking one good look at the babysitter's face will tell you that she's obviously quite freaked out and unsure of what just happened. Obviously there's a chance it could be acting. But do you think there could have been some sort of spirit that caused this to happen? No. What? It's the third child. <laughs> it's the third child. Is this some sort of a prank? It's hard to say for sure. Look at her, look at her smiling. <laughs> oh, God. I think if it is one or two things like thrown down there i would be like oh that's a bit but the whole fucking upstairs mate come on now number three come on let's get some proper freaky deaky shit now that's some real legit stuff mate okay in this video that was posted to reddit we watch as a man is walking his dog outside on a relatively warm looking day all is going perfectly well and the two are both enjoying themselves. That's what she said. <laughs> However, it doesn't take a long time at all for us to realize that something is very strange about this particular piece of footage. Take a look at the sky and see if you notice anything unusual. Oh, right. What is that? A weather balloon? A, a blimp? What is that? What the f Why is that just oh. get over here? Nobody's here. Why are you whispering in my left ear? I don't know why you're whispering in my left ear. You can just talk to me like real good. Please just stop talking to me in my left ear. Guess I'm trying to watch the video, man. Just me. Just me and Hero. And this things in the air. It just launched from somewhere. There's nobody in here. It's just a big field. What is it? Isn't, isn't that the balloon that America shot down or whatever it is? <laughs> <laughs> we got a goddamn balloon in the sky. We gotta take that shit down. Where the f*** did it go? It's just a weather balloon, mate. I, th I really... I don't think there's anything to worry about. To this day, nobody's sure exactly what this is, but the popular theory is that this is none other than an alien UFO that was recorded in the middle of the day. Yeah, I don't know, mate. I think you're reaching a little bit there. I think it's just a weather balloon of some sort. Do you think that this is the case, or do you believe that this is likely something else, such as a balloon? Yes! <laughs> Either way, we might never know the definitive answer. Because it just started from this tree over here. Looks like just a little thing. Uh, this this dude is smoking something, I think. A tree like this. Can't find it anymore. Number ten. Come on now, let's go. Come on, come on. Let's get some. Let's get some. Jimena Baron. An actress and singer from Argentina. I'm not suspicious, straight off the bat. An actress, let's go. <laughs> What's going on, man? <laughs> oh, God. Come on, come on, come With on. almost 6 million followers on Instagram, shared with her followers that while she was at a friend's house, she felt someone touch her. 
She asked her friend for the security camera footage and posted that as well. She said she couldn't find- Remember, she's an actress, okay? You, you're gonna see, like, she's gonna be sitting there watching TV and she's gonna get touched and she's gonna be like, Oh, oh my God! I think I've been touched on the booty! Please help me run! I gotta get out of this house, man! Find anything in the video but that she swears she felt something. <laughs> This absolutely terrifying piece of footage shows the moment in which the incident occurred. Take a good look at the video in question and see what you notice when watching it. Here we go, look. Is that a hand? It's a fucking hand, mate! The fingers of death! It's a fucking hand! She's got a hand on her bloody shoulder, mate! Look at you, huh? Look at you! Holy moly! And also an attack of the killer plenty plants here, look! Ow, ow, ow. Oh, mate! Okay. Okay, but, look, but then again, right? Look at the state of our fingers there, mate! Jesus Christ! Oh no, that's a t-shirt. Is that a t-shirt or is that a hat? That's our hands! Oh look, there's another one here! I'm, I'm, I'm so fo fixated on this one! I, f I didn't even see the big fucking red circle on the right hand side! Holy shit! Fans have also pointed out that you can see fingers on her shoulder- Yes! Oh my god! Older, ...but no one is behind her, interestingly. Oh, hang on. I think this thing is also a glitch. She's got something in her hair, I think, because look, you can see as she turns her head, you can, look, you've got these things, whatever's attached to her hair, right? This is still a mystery that has been left unsolved, but we can only hope that Jimena will one day get the answers that she needs and deserves. <sighs> Okay, that's a bit better, mate. That's a bit better. Let's go. Number one. This truly unnerving video was published to the popular High Strangeness subreddit, which essentially specializes in hosting videos, photos, and stories of some genuinely odd subjects. Okay. The video was originally created by the TikTok user Foul Midden Outdoors. In the video, the uploader can be heard describing something strange in the distance and tells whatever it is, this is our home, and tells it that it needs to leave immediately. Take a good look. They're all over the damn place again tonight. Okay, I'm gonna keep walking towards it. Might actually get the capture. So I, 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 I can see the eyeballs. I can see the eyeballs. Oh, fuck. All right, whatever you are, you need to leave. Stay out of this place. This is our home. Mother, get my gun. I'm loading up. This is our home. Don't you make me shoot now. You need to leave. Look at it. Leave now. Is that Bigfoot? Oh, fuck. He shot it as well. I don't think he's going to come around for a little bit. <laughs> keep it 
away for a while. It's all right, Martha. I think I got the bastard. Oh, God. I hope that does it. I really do. Look at hey, you. Yeah. In, you can see some sort of weird creature lurking around in the. That's like one of those. What's it called? Um. Uh, I can't remember what they're called now. Skinwalkers? Is that a skinwalker? Woods, seemingly trying to spy on the man who recorded the footage. Shit. Whatever this entity's intentions were, Look at his are ass. unknown. Look at the Let's eyeballs. just hope that this man was eventually able to get some answers and is now able to live his life in peace and not have to worry about this frightening creature returning to his property. I would have fucking, I would have ramboed that shit. I would have just, boom, and it just ran towards it like, then jumped up in the sky, fucking stun a spin, loaded the gun again, right? And just gone, boom, again, into an army roll, and then sprung up. <laughs> into a flying kick, and just, knocked it out. Okay. Was this perhaps a crawler, which is a kind of humanoid creature? Or was it simply a hoax? Let me know in the comments. A hoax shooting a bloody gun at it? Ah. On with the next! Alright, let's begin. Number five or six. At this point, it's almost a universally agreed upon thing that Japanese ghost videos are some of the creepiest that you can- Oh god, it... Here we go with a Japanese Freaking me from the depth of the bowel ...and find on the internet. They just have a very distinct feel and tone to them that makes them remarkably off-putting, and this clip is no exception. The video in question was recorded and uploaded to YouTube on August 16th, 2010, by a channel known as Baku DD, Baku and is incredibly mysterious in origin, with nobody really knowing the backstory. In the video, which was certainly shot on a less than stellar camera, we watch as the videographer is panning the camera around this one particular room when suddenly something utterly terrifying happens. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I've got to get invested in this, mate. Let's get invested in this shit. Look at the state of this quality. Oh, fucking hell! <laughs> Oh, it's fucking gone! Oh, look at you! Look at you with your... Fucking horrible, that shit, mate! All of a sudden, a mysteriously ghostly woman in a black dress appears in the room, which causes the woman who is recording the video to let out a loud scream mm. before the video and probably a fart as well. ultimately ends. What do you make of this highly unnerving piece of footage? <sighs> Maximum no arms, please! Get on the bloody gym and work out. I mean, look at the state of this one, just flapping about there. Do you think this is authentic <laughs> ghost footage? If so, who exactly is this mysterious woman dressed in black? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Got nice egg timer shape to her though, to be fair. Number four. The person who uploaded this next piece of footage to their Reddit account says that his mother was in Mexico at the time of the recording, and one of his family friends sent him a video. What that type of bloody? Hang on, it's like what, what photo is this? That absolutely shocked him. He said that the family friend said that they saw the infamous La Llorona, and the video was quite unsettling to say the least. Let's take a look and see for ourselves. Take a look at me now. I can't see shit right now. 
Oh. Oh, fucking hell, mate! Oh, God! <laughs> Oh, it's a dog. Okay, I thought it was her. <laughs> I thought it was her. Oh shit, no, that's freaky. Oh no, it is her. Oh god. Chicken going on here because of you whining, huh? Oh, mate, that's freaky. I don't like that. That's freaky, Deaky. For those who are unfamiliar, La Llorona, also known as the Weeping Woman or the Wailer, oh. is a Mexican mythical vengeful ghost who is said to roam near bodies of water. Mourning her children whom she Oh fucking hell that's horrible that's horrible oh god that's horrible that's fucking horrible Oh Imagine the sorrow No wonder she's crying like that to be looking for her children that drowned in the bloody water mate God She drowned Judging by what this footage shows the possibility of La Llorona being present certainly shouldn't be ruled out. Oh. What do you make of this incredibly creepy piece of footage? I don't know, maybe that is bloody freaky. Never fair! The person who posted this video on Reddit surely caused a lot of commenters to go wild when it comes to speculating what exactly it was that this unknown videographer managed to capture while on an airplane. I've seen this one. I've seen it on the internet. This is, I think this is the most legit um, footage of a UFO. Or what other, what, what you call it now. Like, why change it? It's called a fucking UFO, all right? Look at it. Look at that, mate. This looks, that is absolutely incredible. Look, mate, look. No, look at that! Holy shit! Look at that, man. It's amazing. It's amazing. Wow. In the description of the post, the uploader writes, quote, I'm surprised I haven't seen this video on here yet, but then again, this was just shared recently on Twitter. Do not know the original source, but it's getting a lot of attention and for good reason. In the 20 second clip, you can see this thing pass by very, very close to the pilot. It's shiny metallic with an oval slash triangular shape. That to me, that to me is definitely a UFO. Whether it's an alien UFO, I mean, it's obviously it's a UFO, but is it an alien one? Is it an alien UFO? Another thing that I noticed is we'll the pilot seems to already be noticing and trying to capture another UAP. A oh, a UAP, that's right. Like, stop. St that sounds like some sort of bloody old person's bus ticket. Okay? It's not an OAP. It's a UFO. K okay, unidentified aerial phenomena. In the very beginning of the video, you can see a small black dot almost moving. As the camera tries to autofocus, he loses it, but keeps filming. That's when the main UAP flies by the pilot. So yeah, two UAP, I believe." End quote. This video is definitely the kind that is sure to get the internet in a huge debate over what exactly is happening in the video. Does this video help prove the point that aliens exist and that they're visiting our planet? Mate, one day we're gonna shoot one of these things down, and it's gonna be like a little... 
There's going to be proper, like, like, aliens in there. There's definitely going to be something in there, mate. And it's going to be a grey. I'm guaranteeing you, when we properly find an alien, bastard, okay, it's going to be a grey. Or is this something easily explainable, such as a balloon? I'll I let you know. decide. I don't know. Maybe. Number two! The person who posted this video to their Reddit account, dated July 21st, 2019, says that they had just left to go to the water park for the day. He says that he only checked the footage because the motion sensor went off and triggered the alarm, which caused the security company to call. However, after checking the cameras and probably expecting to see nothing of interest, instead they saw this. Hey, I'm a bit funny, but wouldn't you... When you point that camera down a little bit, I mean, half of it's the ceiling. What do you think about it? Some bastards could be crawling along the ceiling? Oh, God. This is going to be freaky, mate. What the hell? Would you stay in a house like that after you've seen that shit, mate? Oh, look at the table as well. And the chair, look. Oh! That's odd. That is odd. I could just imagine as well. I could just imagine that bloody that chair now raising up and spinning around like the bloody ring bitch film. Like, you know, as it spins around in the air. Oh fucking The uploader says that he made sure to check around the house and see if anything was stolen and thankfully discovered that nothing was. Mm. But still, this video has not been properly explained, which is quite strange to say the least. Mm. What do you guys think was going on in this house? Was there some kind of paranormal activity going on or was it something far less sinister? Far less sinister, mate. Fruit bowls flapping about everywhere. Light bulbs are flickering left, right, centre, willy nilly. Is that a, is that a, a little girl with a long, long hair there as well? Just like looking in the mirror with long hair over her face, right? Doors flapping about. There is no tomorrow. What the hell? We all about less sinister. Be sure to let me know in the comments below. Oh no, that was okay. That was uh, the reflection of the chair. Okay, whatever. Told you something. Freaky about that chair. Number one. Oh dear. <laughs> this next video was filmed on a trail camera, but it's unknown who the owner of the video is. The video itself is highly unnerving. The footage in question is trail cam footage, which appears to be relatively fine and normal at first, but in just a few seconds, you will see that this particular piece of footage is anything but normal. Mm. Let's watch. Watch. Oh god, look at the state of this, mate. Look at the state of it. What the fuck? What the hell is this, man? Okay? It looks like something's made from plasticine. Look at you with your plasticine body. What the hell are you, mate? Holy, that's not that, mate. Okay, I don't know what the hell that is. Look at you! Look at you, slender man bastard! You can't tell me that's human. That ain't human. Nobody, no, no human has an ass like that, mate. Shit, man. 
This dude hasn't eaten in a year. I would be so pissed off if I had to walk around like that. Wouldn't you be pissed off if you had to walk around like that, mate? Everyone, like, where's Ben? Where's Ben? Oh, fuck, Ben. Put your asshole away. Like, stand up. You bollocks and junk hanging out everywhere in your asshole. In, in head height for people to see. Be bloody horrible, man. It looks like he's got a mask. Is that your fucking eyes? Look at you with your bloody eyes. That's... That's your eyes there! Look at him! So pissed off! Look at me, mate, with my plasticine bloody body! Oh, God! That's... That seems so legit! As you can see, a strange, bony creature can be seen making its way across the area that the camera is recording. Many people who have seen this video believe it is a sighting of the rake. For those who- The rake? Oh my god. Oh my god. For unfamiliar, the rake is a monster in the online horror fiction genre, Creepypasta. It is depicted as oh, an unusually shit. tall, hairless, pale, humanoid creature who generally crouches or crawls on all fours. Look at, look at that. Look at you. Do you think that this trail cam managed to capture authentic footage of the rake? Or it's got to be, right? It has to be. I mean, who would... You can't dress up like that because dressing up like that would mean that you're... you're, you're you're putting on something. You, this thing's skinny as ever, mate. Is this something much less terrifying than we think? Much less terrifying. Let's hope that it's the latter. Oh, God. And there you go, mate. They started off slow and turned into absolute bangers. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you liked it. And if you did like it, please subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Take care. Bye-bye. Get the merch at kaspersite.com. Just Rambo it.